Hello, people YouTube. Ah, oh, welcome back. Welcome back to my channel, and welcome back to some more of No Man's Sky, the next update. I mean, it's still No Man's Sky, but it is No Man's Sky next. I will just say No Man's Sky next. Ah, oh dear. Yeah, okay. That was a good intro. Professional YouTuber here. So we're on to episode four. Uh, previous three episodes we basically fixed the the, the ship in the first episode. Uh, second episode, I think we, I think we left the planet and we went to the space station. Um, third episode, we came back to uh, I think this planet. Oh, got to get into my ship. Can I have to sell a bit, uh, a bit shy on uh, health, well shield. So basically, um, I was playing this the other day. I decided to kind of stock up on some materials and stuff because a lot of that stuff can be quite, I wouldn't say boring, but um, I basically got about seven um, launch thrust canisters, whatever you want to call them. A few, so we've got enough. Really got enough to kind of keep ourselves going. We could actually probably, do you know what I might, I might do? I might actually make eight. What I'm actually going to do is maybe just. Oh no, I can only do one more. Yes. So that gives us eight. I might even just round it up to ten, and we'll keep that stocked up as much as possible, so that we've always got fuel. Um, we're kind of getting. I wouldn't say bogged down, but I need to go through this stuff, make sure we've got what we need. Uh, we've got that chromatic metal there. Um, I think we need to build the computer. But I don't want to really build my base until we've really sort of, I don't know, like, completely like, happy with the situation we've got. And I noticed when I did the scan the other day, uh, build technology module. Oh, sorry, buried build. <laughs> buried technology is just over there. So, what I'm, do you know what I'm going to do? Right. Back into the car, heat up, and then we're basically just going to go a straight line there. And if we get into trouble, because remember, we don't want to be like. You know, running out of the uh, or getting getting our kind of hazard protection down. So let's just make a beeline for it. I think we can tag that. Yeah, let's tag that. Right, let's run. I'm hoping it's not so much run, but let's just let's just get there. So it's actually not that far away. It's just over the hill. So let's let's remember. <laughs> Because this is survival mode, let's just look out for a, a place where we could shelter if need be. Oh, there's a place there. Right, okay. So that's really just over there. So we know we can sort of dive in there if need be. Okay, this looks as if it's just... Okay, it's just here. Oh. Oh, you see those lasher plants? I swear. Could we get this buried treasure from this cave entrance? Or is, is that... Do you know what? I'm going to check that option out first. Uh, okay. Cave entrance was... Was it down here? Um, it's funny how things change a little bit. Right, where's this cave entrance? Uh, <laughs> where did this go? Right, hold on a minute here. There's a ship there. Oh my goodness. Right. 
Okay, it, it's right. Um, okay, we do have a cave system. Um, let's get a torch on here. I don't think it's really going to lead us to the. I thought maybe the cave would go. Oh my god. Really? So there's a lot of these elements are actually quite interesting in terms of, uh, you know, like that kind of thing where there's a, a toxic element in the cave. So it makes really getting into caves just that little bit more um, kind of dangerous. I mean, A, you can get lost in a cave, B, if you've got these toxins. Okay, why can I not use my... Oh, it's because of me. I wonder how I can use my, my visor there. Um, yeah, so... It's just one of those things that adds another extra element. So we're going to have to mine this. It's going to get us very good technology. I like to get all of it. Some people leave stuff and it kind of annoys me. Yeah, that's that stuff there. It's dangerous hazardous plant, whatever, whatever it is. Right, so let's go and get this. Uh, first off, I'm going to top up my life support. Right, let's go. So we're out and over the back. I thought we could uh, maybe access that cave and we could maybe have got to it undercover, but it's not going to work that way. So let's get the old uh, terrain manipulator here. But in saying that, we're actually going to be buried anyway. Okay, so here's this technology module. I don't know how to take a picture because it's maybe quite a maybe quite a historic moment. Let's let's actually take a picture. Don't know what I did there, but I just yeah, that'll do it. I'm not really too fast how it works. Um, so yeah, this is uh, I really don't know what this is. I've the first time I've came across this. It's like a big lantern almost. Salvage technology. Is there anything else of note? Why we're stabilised in this cave? So we've got a dioxide deposit. Another dioxide. Another one. There's a sentinel. Those deposits has has a disfora. Just really looking, just in case there's anything else of of note. Cobalt. Right, a star venom. Let's just investigate that. See, I don't think we can actually. Yeah, we can't actually, if you, what's what I'm really looking for here. I don't know whether to actually, what does that take? Sodium, let's just put that in. Because I really don't want to get out here with like half protection. I'd rather have like as much as I can. We've got this uh, star venom, which I think is just over this hill. So 
got to scan this, see what we've got. Oh, we need hazmat going. What's right, Kate? Okay. That's quite annoying. We need to find out how we can make those actually. Because at the end of the day, that that's quite a good fact. Can I tag that? So I'll tag that. I don't really know if I'm going to be able to get that, but. Right, back to the ship. Yeah, I really don't think there's anything else of note. We'll get back to the ship. I don't think we can make the, the gauntlet ship. Whoa, sh sugar. That was, uh, that was kind of dangerous. That could have been... That could have been nasty. So there's a ship. The base computer claims a site for construction. So basically when we build the, the, the computer they can actually make a base. I don't know if I don't know if I want to make my base here. I think what I want to do is maybe see what other planet systems we've got here. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything I can put down that I can come back here. Because I'd quite like to get that star venom because I really don't know if I... Let's see if we can make... Uh, let's pop into technology here. We can only really. I think we need to buy a blueprint for the the hazmat gloves. Now I've tagged that. So if I've tagged that element, can I basically? Let's just take off. Is what I'm thinking of. If I've tagged that. Can I come back to that? Hmm. Right, let's see where the planets and stuff. Because I don't know if I'm going to make my base there, then I'll just make my base. But I want to make a base really where I can. In a way, just not hustle with the fire every few seconds. Let's look at the galaxy map. So I think we've actually got you are here. So we do we have what three planets in this system? Okay, let's let's exit. Leave options. Um, yeah, so let's 
set out for the space station. Quite a bit away, I think. I thought they were quite close there. Let's just get to the space station. I don't really want to be missing the baby pirates too much. It's just this entrance there. Because uh, I don't fancy dying. Let's head in here, let's just see what we can get. <laughs> we did get that Billy technology, which is good. So that, we can change our, the colour of our suit, which I don't know. I quite like the orange and blue at the moment. That is uh, your exosuit, I think. Um, he is... I don't know what he is. Technology. Let's see what he's got, because I don't know what one's got the hazmat. Economy scanner, conflict scanner. These mm. beam. Oh, let's see what else we can. Because I think you can actually put modules as well. Let's see what modules. Do. Starship sealed, sh sealed, starship sealed, shield. Oh my god! I'm a <laughs> yep. Speak English, boy. Yeah, those are quite. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Where's this guy? Yeah. Let's see what he's got. Boatcaster. Mining. Oh, horses. Ok, 
Okay. So there's quite a lot of stuff now. I think before. Oh, I never actually noticed this place. <laughs> oh dear, it's funny when you wave. Right, come on. Why can I not engage? Okay. Um, okay, none of that's working, which is kind of weird. Oh, I know why, because. I don't know how many times I've done that. If you still get that menu open, obviously you can't interact. Oh dear. Yeah, I've got nothing to give him, so. Okay, let's see, because I think there's some stuff we can maybe sell. Keep the there's nothing really salvage technology is quite a lot. I think we should, should maybe keep that. I don't really think there's much that we need to give. Um, I mean, a lot of that stuff we really need anyway. So, right, well, let's just let's go across to the other side. So, I don't know, I don't know what else is over here, there's probably some more stuff. Let's see what he's selling. Okay, I'm back. Sound had cut out there, I didn't realise it went out. So, I need to keep, uh, I say keep an eye on it. Do we get this uh, 
did we risk? Did we risk that uh, fugitive there? but I feel it could be really risky. I don't really know if I want to take that risk at this moment in time. I think that's a planet that we started on. Oh, look, that's undiscovered as well. Uh, silver, pure ferrite, copper. It's a lifeless planet. I think, I think we've been on that. I think that's where we started. So why have we not cleaned it? I think that's a planet. It's unmarked, and that's just our lifeless planet. It's not really a lot there. Silver, pure. It's got pure ferrite though, which could be factory lock. Let's just go down here. So it's really asking us to build these computers. We don't obviously can't work, so basically this is the system that we're in. Uh, I mean I think we could get blueprints for it, but whether we can build it is another issue. Yeah, this is pretty lifeless. I mean to be honest, just because it's a lifeless planet doesn't mean to say that it's not adequate to build a base. Although I suppose. <laughs> Let's see what it's like. Uh, where that silent sentinel's average fauna, obviously <laughs> barren. Um, I mean, it's maybe not the best. Temperatures survivable. Well, please press square to place a custom marker. So there's a copper deposit, which is kind of handy. Um, some more copper. Yeah, plenty of copper here. Anything else? Scan. I really don't think. I enjoy this. Yeah, okay. I mean, there's an auction red pot. I mean, there's stuff here. I mean, there's of stuff for the fuel canisters, which is good. I don't know if this is just a common uh, mineral in all planets, because obviously if you land on a planet you don't have the ability to make this or get the elements to make a, a, a launch system. You could be stuck. Really? I mean, it's a catch to it. I don't know if you. I don't know how the, the base building works in this game. Whether you have the option of. Um, building a base, but like, it was before then you went somewhere else you could just rebuild sort of thing. Because if there's enough of this material, there's okay it's lifeless, but it's survivable in terms of we don't have like really bad weather. We've got plenty of ferrite dust. Which is good. Is that pure ferrite or just normal? Uh, so, I mean, we've got we've got options, I suppose. Scan this. I need to scan a lot more stuff. Scanning can be quite boring, but secondary element. Hydrogen. That's not part of the. Um, okay, so 
There's the, I keep saying Thamium, but it's a uh, it's different name now. Just scan it. Why have we got a... Do we have a... What's that? Hazardous 4? Where, where is that? Hmm. Strange. So basically, this is almost like the moon. It's very basic, but at the same time, it's what I would call a, a survivable planet. It's not. There's not really much. Oh, there's a subterranean relic. Let's go for that. Um, I mean, to build a base here, it kind of would be you know, something that we could survive on. Uh, where did it go? Oh. Did that just disappear? Oh, there it is. So, it's basically just down here. Let's tag it, actually. Right, that highlights it. Let's engage the engage the mining beam. Let's get the torch on. It's really dark in here. Is it? Oh, I could maybe I got a little bit closer to it, but. Disappear? Oh no, come on, don't don't do this to me. Life support power. No. Uh, so where did this thing go? Let's go back out. Did we pick it up? Oh, come on. No. Why you do this? Where did... It, seriously, it hasn't just disappeared. Why? Okay, so... I don't know why... I, I don't know where that element disappeared to. I mean, it was practically what about. I don't know. Um. Let's maybe just blast another little. Bit. Oh no, it's my gun. <laughs> I thought that was it there, yeah, look, that's my gun. Right, so that's disappeared. That that's that's that kinda annoys me a little bit. I don't understand why I mean did we pick it up? Hmm. Uh I don't I don't really get that. I don't know why it disappeared. It was definitely there. Okay, we just kind of. when we started mining towards it, it, it kind of disappeared for, I don't know, did we actually blast it with a gun, but it shouldn't really do that, if you're mining into something then it should be, I mean there's quite a lot here, here's, I mean, there's a lot of ferrite about here, 
There's a lot of basic elements on this. Although it's a lifeless planet, it's, it's quite a lot of resources. What is that? What is that? What is it? Oh, wait, we'll scan this. Is this some kind of rope that's got to cut? Is that what a lava crit? Right, do you want me to do? I'm just going to... Okay, I don't know what that is. It's like a weird sort of... There's a big one across the way. Well, we need an advanced mine laser for that. Okay, do okay. Copy. Nice support power. Yeah. So if we can't get the bigger stuff. Um, so we need an advanced mine laser. We need to look into that. If we can upgrade, or is it a module we have to buy? Or, so I think nanite clusters are going to be important in the game. But there is a lot. Do you know what? I'll do it. I think I might make a base here. Out of the, the three planets that we're on. Well, saying that, we need to recharge our uh, life support. Um, it, it's kind of... I don't know. We don't have the element of like, like extreme cold, which is good. It's a kind of. It's one of those things where it's like a happy medium, isn't it? It's, it's not really a planet that you you get up in the morning and go, "Wow, it's so, I'm so glad to be alive." But there's plenty of resources, and it's kind of simple in its structure. It, it's, there's oxygen here. It's ferrite dust. I mean, we could probably make quite a lot. This, this is a, a, this is a dilemma, but it's certainly, I think the only thing we don't really have a lot of is carbon. That, that is probably actually a, a bit of a worry. Um, hmm. Hmm, I don't know that, that could be. I mean, we can make chromatic metal with, with the copper. I mean, there's a lot of copper deposits. Um, there was that there was buried technology or something. Oh, Where's that here? Does that give you coordinates to something? I, I don't know. Um, I'm kind of semi-confused at the moment. Um, what I'm going to do is I need to end this episode because I did set a target at like 30 to 40 minutes, but um, I kind of scope for a little bit extra uh, episode minutes just because it this game can get quite interesting in terms of ideas, plans, whatever. Because what I'm, what I'm thinking of doing is ending the episode soon and then what I might do is just uh, sort of scout about this planet just to see what we've got, the possibilities of it, if I can survive on it, 
then I might leave the base here just because it's it's a kind of whoa that sentinel just headbutted at me. Um, yeah, so it, it might be a good place just to settle down because it's. I mean, there's no animals that can attack us. There's, there's no really extreme weather where we can. The only thing is, is the. Um, the only thing that's really concerning me a little bit is. I don't think there is oxygen. There's no carbon, I don't think. So. That could be a little bit of a. of an issue. Um, but we can. We can relocate, it's not as if this is like our days and that would be it. The centre needs to go away. Because the other planets that, that are here, I think the one with the ring is where we started. So, I mean. I remember rightly that was a, was that a cool planet. So the survivability in that planet's not as as good as this one. I mean this is it feels like the health bit's been down quicker, but you know you don't have that element of the, the shield so you can just oh, I want this sentinel to go away. I just want to mine this uh, stuff here. Climb up this hill. See what the views are like. But yeah, I mean, it, it, it could be. It's maybe got potential. I mean, it's quite. Yeah, it's quite. There's something appealing to, uh, about this, this planet, really. A good, a good view of the. Ah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Probably need to recharge the wife. See, this is the only thing. The wife support could be getting a little bit. Bit dicey. In fact, I would actually honestly say that we're, we're getting a little bit. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Carbon, I think, is the only one that we don't have, but we could get that off planet, so to speak. Uh, I suppose if we make our... Uh, I suppose if we make our uh, base, we could probably put some form of carbon collection type thing. I don't know. I really don't know Right, I'm going to head back to the ship. As I said, I don't know where that element went to that we, we got that. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, what am I doing? Panic stations. Oh, that's one of those moments you get where you really do panic. See, our life support. I don't is that going down quicker or is it just me? I think when we walk. Oh yeah. Wow, taken. so the atmosphere must be quite basic. So I think that's putting a strain on our uh, life support system. 
What do we do? Do you know it's I don't know. We've got the other planets that we've actually looked at and they've obviously got their own you know, if we land in the ice one, fair enough, we don't have a lot of range, but we do have the ship, so it's not as if it's a problem getting somewhere. Um I mean I suppose we we could always come back here and just mine the, 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 the ferrite dust and stuff. I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to end this episode here. So I'll probably take the customary... Uh, oh. We'll take the customary picture. Trying to get a good angle here. Oh, that could be quite nice with the, with the planet just in the background. Maybe uh, let's get a little bit of elevation. Mm. Uh, let's go up a wee bit. I think a bit there. I think that was quite good. So I'll take out the screenshot. Um, so this is going to be episode 4 done and dusted. I really don't know, I've got a little bit of a decision to make, so what I'm probably going to do is I'll probably play a little bit, kind of off, off video, and maybe find out if I want to make my base here, and mine the copper, and get chromatic metal, because that chromatic metal I think is, I think it's quite a, a good selling price. So that could be an option. Um, I might visit the other planets just to see if they're more viable for for a base just now. But I really don't know what I'm going to do. I'm kind of in between ideas, basically. Uh, there's a lot of stuff here that we can use, which is good. But... I don't know about certain elements because we've got plenty of ferrite dust. I mean, for instance, let's just make up three here, and then let's just make up. I mean, there we go. Let's make probably twelve. Oh no, we can only make. Oh, well, we need to make another plate. So we can make plenty of launch thrust. Which is actually quite a good thing when you think about it. I could actually probably mine, and I could probably make, I think, what, what's it, what, what can we stack? 12, so we can do 20. I mean, good in a way that we can actually, you know, make that. So I might just make up and fill this up to 20 so that we've got enough launch thrust material. And then maybe just think about um, you know, looking at other stuff. I don't know where that technology thing went. I might look at the video, actually, because oh, I don't know. I don't know what happened. But anyway, guys and girls, hope you enjoyed that video. I'm enjoying playing No Man's Sky next. I think it's a really good game. I think it was a good game before the update, but I think this update has just made it so much better. Um... I'm just really enjoying it. It really is a good game. But anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon. Take care. Have a great day. Bye.